football is one of the most popular sports in the world. It's no wonder that right now so many TikTok accounts are showing you the best plays and goals in football. These content creators get a large number of likes on every video as well as a huge number of views. If you want to create an account like that and get a very large number of likes and views yourself, I'll show you exactly how you can make these videos too. Even more, I'll offer you a couple of tips that you can use to make sure that your videos will have success right away. The first step we're going to take is to find content for the TikToks that we're going to create. I recommend going on YouTube since there's already a lot of channels presenting the most spectacular goals or plays from a football game. After we find something interesting, all we have to do is create our own TikTok. We'll go on Google and look up Flixier. We click the first link, then click on Get Started and we're presented with a number of different options. If you already saved the video to your computer, you can drag it over to Flixier, but in this video I'll show you a much easier method. Basically, all we need to do is copy the link to our YouTube video, paste it into Flixier and then click on Import. We'll need to wait a few seconds for our video to process and after the video is done processing, we can look for the bit that we wanted to use in our TikTok. After we find the right bit, we go to the timeline and then use the cut button. Since we don't need it, we'll delete the first part using Ripple Delete. When we get to the end of the clip we want to include, we'll click the cut button again and use Ripple Delete once more. Now we're left with a 13 seconds video. The next step we need to take is to select the right aspect ratio for TikTok. Right now our video is 16 by 9 which is great for YouTube but for TikTok we'll need to go to this menu right here and select 9 by 16 which is a vertical aspect ratio. Now we need to scale and center our video as well as we can. If the camera moves and our subject goes out of frame, we'll fix it easily by pressing the cut button and then repositioning the video. This way we make sure that people viewing our video will have the best experience. After we've made sure that our video looks good, all we have left to do is export it. As I said however, I will give you a couple of tips that will help your TikTok account take off. First up, you need to know that on TikTok you have to get people's attention in the first few seconds. To do this, I suggest adding some text to your video. We'll go to the text tab in this menu and click on add simple text. We'll write something like most beautiful goal and then use the right side menu to edit and customize our text. We'll go to text presets, select one we like and then move the text as high up on the screen as possible. The next step is to move it to the beginning of our TikTok and leave it on for just a few seconds. Two seconds is enough, so we'll get rid of the rest. Now we have a way to hook viewers right at the start, something which will be very important in the future. I also recommend using football compilations of up to one minute, so you can basically have five goals in one minute. This way people will rewatch your TikTok a lot more. Another thing you need to know about this type of videos on TikTok is that there is a lot of competition since there's many accounts that do this. This is why I think it's very important to be unique. For example, instead of looking for the best goals in history, you can look for the best goals of the season. That was it for today's video. I hope you found this video helpful and if you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments.